And as you can see, this thing is just moving left and right, just like this. It just works. <laughs> Hey guys, what's going on? My name's Waz, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a moving platform just like this in build a boat for treasure So as you guys can see, this thing just goes back and forth um, in a straight line very nicely, just like this, and you guys can kind of see the mechanics going on down there. It looks really cool. The mechanics look pretty cool, not gonna lie. It looks pretty cool. But uh, here, let me just reveal this thing to show you how cool this looks. As you can see, it, it looks really cool if you um, make it visible. But anyways, before we move on, um, this was um, found by Snooping Guys. Uh, we were just messing around in a server, and then he found it. I asked him if I could make a video about it. He said yes, so I'm making a video about this. Uh, I'm guessing he's probably not. But anyways, his channel will be linked in the pinned comment make sure to check him out he makes lots of cool build about things like afk farms he does those things and then lots of other insane and weird stuff so yeah that's really all i have to say about this thing so now let's get straight into how to build it all right guys to build this thing you are going to need the screwdriver tool and the keybind tool just keep that in mind before you build this now um i know this could be expensive make if, if you if it's too expensive for you um maybe check out some of my older videos i did some glitches i made a cool magnet glitch video I think it was my most recent video before this one just check out some of my other videos if you don't have enough gold because I made a lot of videos about how to get gold fast but anyways um, to get to build this thing um, uh, you can either use these regular wheels or these back uh, wheels so basically there's front wheels and back wheels with the new one the back wheels are darker than the front ones so um, you guys could buy um, this is cheaper but I believe this one actually works better so um, what I mean by that is if you buy this you get four and you only need four but if you buy this you get two back wheels so you'll need to buy this twice but it works better but if you get so basically if you guys don't have the back wheels just use those if you guys do use the these wheels but anyways we're, let's just get straight into how to build it first we're gonna turn off anchor block you can leave it on but let's just let's just forget about that because I don't want to confuse you guys so we're just gonna place a wheel facing up like this um, again make sure it's these back wheels as you can see the front wheels are lighter so it's just the dark gray kind of ones like this and then we're gonna go ahead and grab a block I'm just gonna use plastic because it is close to the wheels so I can um, build with plastic and go to my wheels easily we're gonna place one plastic block like this and then extend it out however much you want um, you could make it really long or really short I'm just gonna go one two three four five five like this and then we're gonna grab our uh, another wheel and we're gonna place it right on the last block of this and then of course we're just gonna go ahead and do this again um, just do this uh, a few times so let's just go one two three four five I'll tell you when to stop um, just stop once you have placed four wheels okay um, so let's just go ahead this is gonna be our third wheel um, and then let's just go ahead and do uh, this thing we're just gonna do this again place one go one two three four five just like that and then here is our fourth wheel we're just gonna place our fourth wheel once you place your fourth wheel just leave it like that and it should look like this you should have four wheels and three um, like long things and then what you guys want to do is you want to place uh, another plastic block and you guys can just um, move it up like this if you don't have the scale tool you can just build this um, you do not need the scale tool whatsoever in this build but then you're just gonna make a little platform like this and there you go that is the actual building part done but if you guys were to start this thing up it would not work at all it would just not even look even close to what it's supposed to do so there are a few things we need to do so the first thing is we're gonna grab our screwdriver tool select all set the wheel torque to the green like this then set your wheel speed to like one or something just somewhere around one um, and then it should be that should be the settings done but we're still not done yet there's one more thing we have to do we have to get out our chair get out our bind tool you want to click the top wheel then click the chair and you want w to go backwards and then uh s to go forwards so it's reversed from normal normally it would be w forwards s backwards but it's reversed and then you want to do the same thing with the second wheel up so not the first wheel but the second wheel so we're gonna click that click the same chair we're gonna do w to go backwards and then uh, S to go forwards and now we have it pretty much done now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and save this thing and then reload it I recommend doing this just because it is sometimes it glitches out then we're gonna sit in this chair now this part you have to pay close attention to we're gonna hold W and as you can see this is what it should do now it's clearly not what it's supposed to be doing so um I'm just gonna go through this pretty slowly so you see when it makes that S shape like that it kind of made an S shape it goes over there one time once it gets the S shape, I want you guys to hold S while holding W. So you want to start holding S and W 
when it shows the S shape. So next time it comes around, I will do that, and, and then I'll show you what it does. It should do something, so let's just go ahead and do that, and then hold S, and then it should do something like this, all right? Now, you just want this thing to kind of keep going like this, and then once, uh, once sometimes this works, sometimes it doesn't, but um, once you get this going for a little, for just, um, once you have this happening, I want you to let go of S, but keep holding W. Now, there's a pretty good chance that this will just start working. Like, as you can see, mine just started working. But if it doesn't work, then you just want to reload it and try it again, okay? Um, it's pretty weird, but now I'm only holding W on my keyboard, okay? I'm only holding W. So, how do you get this thing working without, like, the chair at all? While still holding W, you want to jump out, okay? So, then... Now it should be going on its own, all right? Then you can just delete the chair, and as you can see, this thing is moving back and forth on its own. So let's just go over that one more time just to clear it up. So let's just load this thing back in, and let's just go over this one more time. So we're gonna sit in the chair, hold W until it makes the S shape, then start holding S, uh, hold S when it shows the S, I guess, that makes sense. And then wait for this to come around a bit, and then at some point, just let go of the S, and then it should work. Um, as you can see, this is working. Now, this one is spinning a bit. You see, it's just, it's just kind of weird. It's, it's, it's a pretty weird thing. It, it's, it's just weird. So, you, again, hold W until it shows S, and once it shows S, you hold S. It's pretty simple. And then, at some point, you just let go of S. Um, it really just... You see, this is an example of it not working. So, if it doesn't work, you can just mess around with it. Um, if it doesn't work, I just recommend reloading the whole thing, because that just makes it easier. So, again, hold W. Wait for it to show the S shape shape kind of thing hold s it should do this Ooh, and then wait for this to come around uh let go of s at some point and sometimes it'll work sometimes it won't um if it doesn't work you, when you let go of s um it would it's, it would still be doing this i guess and if you hold s um sometimes it's just really weird so as you can see now it's working um you just gotta mess with it um i'll go over this even i'll just go over this even one more time even like I, i'm gonna do this a lot just so you guys understand you're gonna hold w until it shows s and then hold S, and then let go of S at some point, and then it should be working, if not, just do it again. But there we go, guys. As you can see, this thing is now working. Now, if you guys want to hide this, you can go ahead, um, make everything invisible, just like this. Uh, wait, let me just go ahead and do this like that. And then go ahead, uh, find this, the platform, and then make this visible. And then you want to find the pole that's holding the platform and turn off collisions, alright? And then what you guys can do is you can go ahead and just make a little uh, platform kind of thing um, underneath this. So, oh, that's not what I wanted. Oh, I broke it, guys. I broke it. I messed it up. Uh, let's try that again. Um, I'm going to go fast. I'm just going to set this up really quickly like this. Um, once you understand how to do this, it should not be too much of a problem to actually get working. Uh, let's just do, uh, let me try that again. I know, I know I've done this a bit too much, but I gotta try this again. I wanna show you guys, um, how to do this. So let's just go ahead and set this up real quick like this. Boom, there we go. It's set up. It's moving back and forth. Uh, we can just do that. And there we go. We got it working. So now what we're gonna do is we can go ahead and, uh, let's do that one thing again. Let's set this all to invisible. Wait, no, I did not tell you to be invisible. That and then that. Do not be invisible. And then we make this collisions off. I I know it can be kind of confusing, but um, I'm pretty sure I made it pretty clear. Uh, that kind of rhymed, I guess. Whatever, it doesn't matter. But yeah, then we could just go ahead, make ourselves a little bit of a platform. Uh, let's wait for it to get out of the way before we scale it out. Let's just scale this out like that. And as you can see, um, we can just hide this uh, so that n you can't even tell that uh, there's any mechanics going on. It looks really cool if you do it like this. As you can see, it just works like this. Um, let's just go ahead and hop on here uh, just to show you. And as you can see, this thing is just moving left and right just like this. It just works perfectly. And no one can really see what's going on unless they look down here. It it's just a really cool kind of mechanic thing that is in the game. So, yeah, that is probably going to wrap up the video, guys. I hope you guys found this um useful i guess i hope you think this is cool this is pretty cool i guess but anyways that's really gonna wrap up this video guys make sure to join the discord if you have not already it's in the description um if you guys have discord account make sure just try join the discord we do some giveaways and other random stuff it's just good to be in the discord it's fun and yeah and you can post your glitches there and i might even you might be even get in a video if you're lucky so yeah that's really gonna be it for this video guys i hope you guys enjoyed make sure to leave a like a comment subscribe. I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.